Okay, in this next part, um, we're going to show you how to uh, make a link between a structure in the brain called the hypothalamus. Let me explain that. Um, this is a little more advanced, and it's quite um, advanced and powerful. So rather than get into explain what it is, I'm just going to show you how to do it with some brief explanation. There's um, a front part of the hypothalamus, and there's the back part. The hypothalamus is the thing in the body that controls. It's kind of like the owner of the football team. It controls all the different organs. It's like the conductor of the symphony. It's like the thing that's running the show, and it's up in the brain. It's deep inside the brain. Well, there's an acupressure for it, but because there's a back part and a front part of it, the front part of it is the one that controls the female menstrual cycle. So we're going to only work on the front part, all right? And it just so happens to, we can access it through an acupressure point. And would you like to know where that is? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's exactly, directly right there. Okay. So it's at that point right there. So now what she's going to be doing is she's going to be touching with this finger, this finger right here. You're going to come directly in there. So I want you to look from the side. You see how she's at the, the, the point that's the most shallow. You're not higher, low, it's right there. She's going to hold that right like that, okay? Now, while she's holding that, um, she's going to be holding the ovary, okay? And I'm going to be doing the back, back points just like I showed you with this part, this part of the device right through here, this one right here. We'll do this part. So we're going to come down and do this 20 times. I'm just going to rub down. We're not going to rub up. We're only rubbing down. If you rub up, you'll erase it. Okay. Now, what is this actually doing? Just think about it. What happens is you have these hormones every month that are on a timing mechanism, a 28-day cycle. And every month, it releases different things. Day uh, 14 you release uh, eggs, okay? That's where you're most fertile. So it goes from the brain down to the ovary. Rolling, okay. and go. Okay, so I'm rubbing down 20 times on the same points that I showed you. And what we're doing is we're creating a link from one part of her body to the next. And it just so happens that every month her menstrual cycle is on this timing mechanism, and what we're doing is we're facilitating, we're increasing that connection, so to speak. We're kind of relinking that, so that way hormones are sent and received into the right ovary correctly. Now, every other month, one ovary works, and then the other month, another ovary works, so they're not always working at the same time. That's why women have problems with, like, every other month it's worse, okay? So I just did it 20 times. Now go ahead and um, switch, yeah, okay, good. So I'm relinking the front part of the what's called the hypothalamus with her left ovary. And this is, this is really opening up that pathway between the hypothalamus and the left ovary. And if there's any problem between that communication, this will help it. She's gonna, it's gonna make the cycle really smooth less cramping, less pain. So I do this 20 times. It just so happens where she's pressing, that part of the hypothalamus also controls um, the sleeping mechanism too, but it's not going to actually affect the sleep when you do this. That's a different treatment. But it's on, that's why women have a problem with uh, hot flashes at night. It's their timing mechanism. So now we're going to do one last thing. Hold this on the uterus. Good, and then touch that point. So we're going to do this one 20 times. And she will find that her menstrual cycle is just going to be better the next time she has it. So I normally do this procedure any time the person has any problem related to female um, cycle. Okay, so that's how you would do that procedure.